Hello guys, so welcome to my YouTube channel, The Charming Weirdo. So today I'm going to show you how to uh, solve a simple issue, but it, that might be a headache for you for so long. So you might have tried lots of things, but no luck, right? So the issue I'm going to talk about today is uh, this black screen uh, when you add a display capture in OBS Studio. So when you add a display capture like this, and I, will, I only have one screen, so I will pick that and click OK. And now if this is working fine, you must see the preview of your screen here, but it is black as you can see. So you might have tried lots of things, but still uh, you have uh, no luck with solving the issue. So there are two ways two steps uh, to solve this sometimes uh, doing one step will solve this for you or else you have to go for both the steps so first of all uh, I'll show you the first step so if you are using an NVIDIA uh, graphic card so you might have this NVIDIA settings then go to NVIDIA control panel and let it open um, okay then from the nvidia control panel go to this manage 3d settings and from there uh, go to the tab uh, program settings so in here you can change settings for specific programs so from here you have to pick obs studio and keep in mind if you are using a 64 bit version of windows uh, so you have to pick obs studio 64 bit exe so if it is not listed here you can go to add click on add and uh, you can browse the exe file from there okay i clicked on add and it's taking a bit of time to open okay we'll see it's not responding okay now from here uh, you can click on browse and select the program and after you pick it uh, you can select from here which video card you should use so if you have the in this integrated graphics option click on it and then press apply okay it is applying the settings okay now uh, you can close uh, the NVIDIA control panel and try to restart the OBS studio okay still in my case uh, our step is not working still the screen is black so next step is uh, you got to change something on settings uh, open your settings app windows settings up and then go to display settings from display settings scroll down and you will see this option graphic settings click on it and from here uh, you have to click browse and from here you have to pick the obs studio 6 if you're using 64 bit you have to pick the 64 bit exe file so i will create select my one which is 64 bit and click add then uh, you will see obi studio displayed here like this and then you have to click on the options and pick power saving mode here and then click on save button right now close the settings and restart the OBS studio okay now you can see it's working so thank you for watching hope this will help you so hope to see you on another video thank you